And Dan, the victim's mother says she's keeping her son out of the school until changes are made and she knows he's safe. Disturbing video from Vista Verde Middle School. A student attacked while others record video and watch. He grabbed me from the back and like he dropped me to the floor and like he started punching me in the, in the face and the, in the back of my head. The victim left with bruises on his body. His mother says the school told her he got into a fight, but it was a different conversation she had with the Greenfield police officer when he came to check on her son after this video started circulating online. The police showed me the video and I was in shock because the, the school never warned me about it. She went to the school Monday, meeting with the principal and vice principal. They promised me everything will be fine, that they will be changing her schedule right away. Changing the schedule to make sure none of the kids involved in the incident were in classes with her son. But come the next day, she said nothing changed. The first thing when he saw him, he was telling my, my son that he was a snitch, that he was a chicken, and he was bullying again my son. We reached out to the school district but have not received a response. We did find bullying guidelines on their website. The school district says they strictly prohibit bullying and anyone who bullies will be punished. They also have steps to take if a child has been bullied. Step one, work with your child to identify the problem. Step two, go work with the school. But the victim's mother said she's tried that and now she's keeping her son out of school until the district calls her to tell her changes have been made. The school exposed my son again to bullying when they couldn't prevent that and then I take out my son from school that day. Now we also reached out to Vista Verde Middle School and they have not gotten back to us. Reporting in Salinas, I'm Christopher Salas, KSBW Action News 8.